In May of 1993, an outbreak of an unexplained pulmonary illness occurred in the southwestern United States. Within a short period, investigators discovered that five young, healthy people had all died after acute respiratory failure. By November, the specific hantavirus that caused the outbreak was isolated. Since then, hantavirus outbreaks have occurred in a number of places across the U.S. Hantavirus pulmonary syndrome, or HPS, is a severe, sometimes fatal, respiratory disease caused by infection with a hantavirus. Anyone who comes in contact with rodents that carry hantavirus is at risk of HPS. Rodent infestation in and around the home remains a primary risk for hantavirus exposure. Even healthy people are at risk for HPS infection if exposed to the virus. In the United States, deer mice, cotton rats, and rice rats are the reservoir of the virus. The rodents shed the virus in their urine, droppings, and saliva. When fresh rodent urine, droppings, or nesting materials are stirred up, tiny droplets containing the virus get into the air. It can be transmitted to people when they breathe air contaminated with the virus. There are several additional ways rodents may spread hantavirus to people. They include, if a rodent with the virus bites someone, the virus may spread to that person, but this type of transmission is rare. Researchers believe that people may be able to get the virus if they touch something that has been contaminated and then touch their nose or mouth. And researchers also suspect people can become infected if they eat food contaminated by urine, droppings, or saliva from an infected rodent. To learn more about the hantavirus, HPS, or other infectious diseases and environmental or indoor air quality issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.